Riverina will benefit from a $50 million boost to XBT rail services across New South Wales. The state government says it will improve train comfort and reliability and bring people back on board. A commitment to rail passengers in the bush. A faster, modern, more comfortable country train fleet will be rolling down the track by 2020. 79 locomotive and passenger carriages will be replaced to include Wi-Fi connectivity, iPhone plug access and improved services for people with a disability. It had become abundantly clear that the standard of the XPT was aged and tired and no longer offered the appropriate levels of service and comfort for that rail journey. We have a tired train. It's a train which doesn't have the necessary modern day facilities to support the travelling community. The Sydney to Melbourne XPT service runs through a number of Riverina centres, including Wagga, Cootamundra, Harden and Junee. The investment will advance the fleet considerably in the hope of reviving the ailing public transport. We need to get people back onto country passenger rail. Uh, we have seen a 10% decline in terms of the people catching country trains uh, in the last five years alone. Uh, so what we want to do is make it an exciting proposition again uh, so that people do get back onto the trains. Transport and Infrastructure Minister Andrew Constance hasn't ruled out replacing more than 50 non-XPT trains that serve key regional centres such as Griffith. They're mid-life. Uh, quite often that can mean a major investment in terms of improving the quality of those trains uh, mid-life. The XPT trains of course are nearing the end of their service at 35 years and that's why we're taking this step with them but uh, also happy to look at exploring and endeavour in this mix. Jordan Matthews, Win News.